Tonight, Donald Trump is returning to a Grand Avenue billboard that went viral after his 2016 election as president. 12 News journalist Bram Bresnik reports that the billboard owner and artist make no apologies for what are bound to be some controversial images of Trump. Bram? At Caribe, Beatrice Moore has been a leader of the Grand Avenue art scene for many years. She's put her stamp on the area with a billboard near 11th Avenue and Grand, a popular route into downtown Phoenix. Drivers are about to get an eyeful of Donald Trump. Beatrice Moore can plaster anything she wants on the Grand Avenue billboard she owns. It's kind of amazing how visual imagery can create uh, such a stir. Moore has done much more than create a stir with the progressive political art she promotes. And when people started showing up with their cameras from foreign countries and you know even nationwide we had no idea it would that would happen seven years ago after donald trump's election victory moore's billboard stopped traffic images of the so-called trump apocalypse had gone viral how can you look up to a person like that how can that be a role model for you a new billboard scheduled to go up Friday shows Trump in diapers with images of Hitler fried chicken, the Confederate flag, January 6th, and Vladimir Putin. Moore makes no apologies. So it's symbolism. You know, a lot of artwork has symbolism in. That's why it's effective. Moore's longtime collaborator, artist Karen Fiorito, says facts and free speech are on their side. I'm not expressing something that's not based in factuality. He actually said these things. But both Moore and Fiorito are bracing for the kind of threats they received after the first Trump billboard went up. I've been down this road. Um, I know it can be scary. I'm not afraid. And this new Trump billboard is scheduled to be installed on Friday. Beatrice Moore provided the billboard image to 12 News. We'll follow up with reaction to it. Let's send it back to you.